Scott, you were talking about solar heating. Yes. Well, there's two types. There's photovoltaic, uh -huh. right? Right. Electric panels spinning your meter backwards. And then there's solar thermal. And both of them are good. Some may be better for some customers, while others are better for the other customers. Better like better financially, better financial investment. And better performance, right. depending on what climate they're in. Most people, I think, think of solar heating as sunlight shining on panels and heating the house directly. Like with the liquid or air. Right. But you're saying solar electric, where solar electric panels power a heat pump. Right. Well, it, and certainly a heat pump is much more efficient than an old air conditioner, uh, but it also works in the summertime and the winter because a heat pump can, in the summertime, take heat out of the house. And in the wintertime, even though it might be cool outside or even cold, it can put heat from the air into the house. Oh, so if I buy solar electric, it's going to work for me all year round. But if I buy solar space heating or solar hot water heating, it's only going to work during the winter. That's correct. Because that's the only time I need that solar space heat. That's correct. So if you're in a southern climate where it's hot in the summertime, probably PV solar for heating and cooling your house is a better investment. Up north, where you don't really have much air conditioning, maybe solar thermal is better, and you just stay away from the heat pump. Uh, the photovoltaic is solar heating because it can power heating and air conditioning. And one of the reasons why photovoltaic is such a good deal is because it does both. When you buy solar heating, you only need that during the winter. 